All right, it's that time once again for another Isle of Conquest, June the 16th, 2023. Looks like we have 22 people in here from the SAS crew. I am on I shot the sheriff. We're going to head on up to the hangar. Looks like we didn't have anybody go to the dock, so we're not going through the fast plan here. Don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, notification bell. Wow, they had a ring already up the hill, but I just ran right past it. <laughs> they didn't quite get it down enough the hill to actually prevent us from getting up. Nice ice wall to the left there. It blocks out most of the team, but what's that wall to the right? <laughs> what was that supposed to block, man? It was actually on the other side of the flag. And you got the dragon fire there that's cutting off their LOS. Should be taking some people out here. Got some of the paladins down. The tank's up here. Someone's getting ported. Who got ported? Was it them or us? <laughs> that's always fun to figure out. Rogue's going to go down. Mage is almost dead, too. I got the kill on the mage. Now we can focus on the rogue. They still have quite a few people up here. Got to get some of these more kills, though. We've gotten 11 so far. They've gotten three. Paladin Bubbles there. We got a Shaman almost down. Druid next. Chuck Norris. Nice name, man. I like that one. Uh, he's still going to go down, though. Guess he really wasn't the Chuck Norris. <laughs> he should be able to snap his fingers and everybody would be dead like Thanos, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, the hunter's gonna turtle and run and jump off the cliff. Well, that's too bad. Can still fight him from here though, right? Got a little bit of range. Come on. Ah, he's gonna go ahead and glider out of there. Bring glaives to the hangar. Yeah, we got docks tapped with only one person. That means if we do bring any glaives, it's only gonna be one person bringing them. So, gotta get people over to the docks ASAP before they start resurrecting out of their base. You know how that goes, though. There it is, the one glaive. <laughs> we got one. We got one, boys. Got some flares down here. Put your traps down. Always use track humanoids so you can see when they're coming in. Wow, I got heals. We've seen them before. The tank. And it looks like you got a druid here with them. Got to get these two down so they don't kill our one glaive. Yeah, you got your hammer of justice. I'm going to trinket that. Disengage away. He's still got me on target. Pretty far away. Nice stun there. Probably should bait him away and run away from the glaive, though. If he's going to chase me, maybe I can get him further away. No, he's got wise to that and started going toward the glaive anyway. Loot this body here so the paladin can't battle res. Now we can start doing damage to him. Should be able to take the tank out now. He's got the glaive targeted. Oh, another shield. Kill the NPC. Kill the NPC. There's two NPCs up at once, man. How the hell? That's some bullshit right there. Not only does he have that, now he has the fucking Divine Shield. <laughs> yeah, that's not overpowered at all, right? <laughs> Where are our, our priests for that massive spell? There was a good mind control, at least. <laughs> guess the mind control was probably on cooldown. I'm going to guess. He's going to try and come back again, though. He's got help this time. He's got a Warlock and a Warrior, too. Up, oh, he used Freedom and walked right through that. Mind control again. Do you have enough... Guess to run into the edge, though? No, you did not. You're running them the other way. Now the mage is on our glaive, too. We've already done massive amounts of damage to their gate, though. Their gate's down to 20%. Ours is at 85%. So even if they take out the glaive here, it doesn't even matter. It's really done its damage. Nice port. Got some of them ported. Where'd they go? <laughs> One of them got away. Two of them got away. The warrior might be able to get back up here if he charges. Yep, see, that's what it was. He charged. We actually got two glaives up here, too. Yep. One goes down there. Then we got to take out the mage and the warrior before they take out the last one. It's really, really low. I don't have high hopes that we're going to save it. It's going to be close. Got the warrior down. The mage can't finish it. Woo, barely. Loot the body. One glaive is better than none. Got all these bodies looted. Like I said, our gate's still at 85. Their gate's still going down. One more pass for sure, and we're all in their base. Warlock goes down the hill there. Take him out before he goes. Oh, man. He got a reprieve there. He was so low on HP. Wow, I got heals. is coming back over here. Doesn't really matter now, though. The gate's down in 2% here. There's really no reason for us to sit here and fight him. Trinket at that. Yeah. Hi. Knocked him down the cliff. <laughs> he can still do damage to the glaive. It doesn't matter, though. Glaive is down. Yep. Now we can get out of here, head to the Alliance base, grab a bomb just in case. You never know if they want to come back and turtle. Now we can start taking out the high commander. Got a lot of people that are spread all over the map. 
So the DPS is going to be slow, of course, on the High Commander at first. Now we just got to wait for the rest of our team to help finish them. They took the hangar from us. We have workshop still. Now the, wow, I got heels is going to come in the boss room. Well, I mean, he thought he could survive before with this many people. He's not going to be able to survive that much longer, right? We got ported. <laughs> that wasn't that far of a port, though. It's more fun if you can port them behind the castle. Then they got to run all the way around, too. Especially if they were in combat, too, because it takes them a couple seconds to drop combat. He's not even going to make it up here before the boss is dead, probably. Nope, he's going to make it barely. Just in time to see your boss hit 30% execute range. Got the crushing leap off. Yep, should be able to take him out. Yeah, he's going to go down. Kill him before you kill the high commander. Yes. And last 10%. That's all they brought to defend their base, though. Another one for the history books here. Lilith, man, the top killing blows, man, on a warrior. And looks like martyr for the top hills. May all of your random battlegrounds be epic. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. Until next time, GG for the whore.